We are in the car and we're off to my band clinic. It's about an hour drive. We are actually driving to Hollywood. It's, it is called <laughs> like that. So I will see you probably after it. We're at the clinic with Wendy and we're going to show you what is involved in one of the appointments. So this is Wendy and she's my Hi. band nurse and she's lovely. <laughs> Thank you. And so first there is a weigh-in and this is the scale that kind of gives you all like the body composition, isn't it? Correct, yeah. yes. So it tells you what the muscle mass is, the fat mass, the water content in your body and in your cells and blood, etc. And, and obviously an ideal uh, weight that you should be for your height, age and gender. Step so, on, Julie. This is the scale. <laughs> There's a little bit of information that we need to put in, yep. um, which is when it's finished monitoring and keeping nice and still, we've got to put that we're a standard female, um, we're not athletic or anything like that. Is it okay for me to hold the camera for me? Yes, yeah. it's okay. And um, age, Julie? 30, 30 for another week. <laughs> 30 for in a week, another week, so you're 33 now. No, 30. Oh, you're 30? I'll be, I'll, be, I'll be 31 next week. Oh. So you're still 30, right? Yeah. And how tall are you in feet and inches? In five, five. Five, five. Okay. And it's a very clever machine. It works everything out for you. So it just prints a little receipt like that. Yes. The most important thing here is obviously weight loss surgery is about losing weight, and the particular dangerous weight is the fat mm -hmm. and the content and visceral fat without showing her yeah. the visceral fat is 16 which is over what it should be yeah. which the benchmark is 13 so we need to do a little bit of active work um, and now I'm seeing Julie regularly um, we can monitor her until she's into a nice range yeah yeah gastric band adjustments are obviously a skilled process um, but obviously once you know what you're doing you feel for the port, which is a pound coin size button, really, underneath skin and fat. You can hear the children in the background. Needle just gently onto the skin, and then we're just going to push. Just push in, there we are. And it's a direct feel um, when you know that you're in that part because it's like a, a putting a pencil through a rubber. It's that spongy feeling. And then we're going to very carefully, slowly measure what fluid is in Julie. So we've got some accuracy of what is in the collar of the band, the neck of the band, not the tubing, just in the band itself. I primed my syringe with a mill of fluid and her fluid is lovely and clear. So there's no signs of any erosion or anything nasty there. And it's up to five. Julie's always been a little bit sensitive. It's actually emptying a little bit more. And we're up to five and a half. Owen, Owen, Owen. Five and a half, okay. So that's Julie's fluid back in. Another half a mil. And it's showing a little bit of pressure there. So I'm not going to put all that fluid in. I'm just going to leave it now. She's got five in the colour of the band. I don't want to put any more in because that would be too much, yeah, too much pressure. And that's it really, just a little plaster on. If Julie's not sensitive to plasters. Okay, yeah, lovely. Um, following gastric band adjustments, um, it's important, especially when we've put the fluid into the band, that the patient follows a guide, a guideline, um, and it's really to have fluids for the first three days, just in case there's any swelling that takes place. You should not ever go home and eat a normal meal. Um, this is a process that takes time to develop so that you can get used to that feeling of having some more food fluid in your band. The idea is to reduce the portion sizes rather than not being able to eat or drink at all. So that's what is very important. And on the bottom of my um, treatment card, the post adjustment advice, are all the contact numbers. Yeah. If you can hear me. Yeah. <laughs> so when is very children friendly, as you can see, you can bring your children. <laughs> Owen, 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 shh, we're trying to hear us. Owen, we need everybody to hear, to hear Wendy, okay? Oh, bless. I'll put a link of those details yes. in the description of the video anyway, so you can have them directly. Once a patient is registered with myself, once a patient is registered with myself, I am on call for any advice or concerns. Okay, thank you.